Fabulous promo, and of course, this this is not Pigeon 72. Of, co of course, it's not episode 4, because they just don't like showing episodes in order. They they just don't. But this is for the episode Solo Crusher. So, so Solo Crusher? What what the hell kind of villain name is that? Solo Crusher? Like, what, what the hell are they going to do? Like, crush people? Is that their thing? Like, what does the Solo have to deal with Crusher? I don't, I don't really understand this villain name, but whatever, whatever. But the interesting part part about this episode is that this will be the episode that Zoe gets introduced. <laughs> you know, Chloe's sister that she apparently has, even though they have never once established that Chloe has a sister, but, yep, she she sure does. It's, it's, it's definitely not shooting Horde into the plot in any way. No, no. She, she, she has always had a sister. Even though she's never mentioned it once. She, she is, she's always, always had a sister. Yes, yes, this, this, this is true. And also, Zoe will be the new holder of the Beam Reckless, so she's clearly going to be a good person, <laughs> which is kind of surprising that there's actually going to be a uh, bourgeois. That's a good person, and I'm going to like. Wow, what, what a shock. There's, there's actually going to be a good person, not, 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 not just a bitch in the bourgeois family. Wow, I, I can't believe that they actually spawn something that's pure. I'm surprised. I mean, sure, I I don't know what Zoe's personality is like, but from what I've seen of her, just just the little pictures and and, and uh, like her facial expressions, I think I'm actually gonna fall in love with this character. I I think this is gonna be a great addition to the Miraculous Family. Huh? Unlike Luca. Now, now I'm sorry that I keep bringing out Luca, but it's just I've only seen pictures of Zoe, but I can tell you already, she has a lot more personality than than Luca has ever shown on screen. Uh, you know, when 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 they're writing Zoe, they're like, huh, let's make this an interesting character. When they design Luca, they're like, oh, let's let's just make a generic ass love rival character. <laughs> he doesn't need a personality. All he needs to do is be nice and people will like him. Ha ha. Yeah, and also let's let's make sure he doesn't have any flaws so he's perfect so so no one will hate him. Well, guess what? I hate him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I, I will go over this in my Why I Hate Luca video too. So, yeah, stay, stay tuned for that. But, yeah, anyway, Solo Crusher. I'm looking forward to this episode because <laughs> cause it will introduce Zoe, I guess. I don't I don't know, but anyways, let's let's go ahead and watch this promo. I've been talking long enough. Let's let's watch. Three, two, one, let's go. Huh? What, what, what the hell are you even saying? Uh, oh shit, there she is. There's Zoe, and wow, I like her already. Uh, oh, oh, oh shit, there seems to be some tension between you two. I mean, I makes sense because you know Chloe's a bitch after all. But uh, oh, what happened to you? Uh, Oh, what the hell is that? Why, why, why does she have antlers? Why, why does a person named Solo Crusher have antlers on her head? What the hell? Also, I wasn't expecting Zoe to get akumatized, but okay. So, anyways, that was the promo, and damn, that was that was short. That was like that was like twenty seconds long. Jesus Christ, that was that was literally nothing. But that told me everything I need to know. Uh, that just told me that Chloe is a bitch. I mean, we already knew that, but it seems like Chloe and, um, Zoe, um, don't really have the best, um, relationship, and also Zoe and Chloe. Zoe, Chloe, Zoe, Chloe, actually, um, that's actually not, that actually kind of sounds similar. Zoe, Chloe, Zoe, Chloe, Zoe, Chloe, Zoe, Chloe, huh. But anyways, enough of that. My question is, um, where the hell has Zoe been all this time? Now, I have heard that Zoe's basically Chloe's half-sister, but still, like, where the hell has Zoe been all this time, and why has no one mentioned her? I guess it kind of makes sense for Chloe not to mention her, just because it seems like they don't like each other, but still, it's kind of weird that the father, nor the mother, has ever mentioned her existence before. But, oh, I'm, I'm looking forward to this explanation. I, I'm so excited to hear the bullshit they're gonna come up with uh, explaining Chloe's sister. I'm ve very much looking forward to that, to, to why she hasn't shown up in the show till now and why she's gonna be a main character from now on. I'm so excited to he hear that bullshit. Yeah, I'm, I'm so excited. I, I, I'm telling you now. It's gonna be bullshit. It, 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 it ain't gonna be a pretty explanation at all. It, it ain't gonna make sense either, but... <laughs> whatever, they're gonna try. They, they are gonna try the shoe horn in this information, but... Whatever. I'm, like, I'm not hating on Zoe. Like, I like Zoe already, though she hasn't said a word. <laughs> but her face tells me everything. Tells me that I'm going to like 
this character. And honestly, I was kind of expecting her to be a happy, low, lucky girl just be, just from the stuff we've seen. But no, it seems like she kind of has some trauma or, or just some issues, mainly with Chloe. I'm assuming it's just with Chloe. But yeah, I'm interested to know, like, what is her deal? Why does she get akumatized? What, what did Chloe and Zoe talk about? Does Zoe want to get close to Chloe? Don't know why you want to. She's a bitch, but whatever. These, these are questions I want. Also, why does she have antlers? That is the most important question. Why does she have antlers in her villain form? That don't make sense. Like, why, what, what, why? Why? But anyways, yeah, that's, that's kind of all I really want to talk about. I can't really think of anything else to talk about, because that was only like 20 seconds, but still, it, it kind of brought up a lot of questions, so, yeah. Anyways, I guess that's really it for me, so thank you all for watching. Please like, subscribe, and of course, I'm gonna see you all next time. See ya, see, see you all. Yeah, so goodbye, everybody. Uh, goodbye. <laughs>